All right. As, uh, as you may know, you may not know. I should mention this, though. Right now, uh, folks, all the networks are in the middle of May sweeps. You know what sweeps are? Okay, this will go well. Um, <laughs> sweeps. Sweeps are when advertising rates are established, okay? And you've heard about this. It's like the big May sweeps. So that's when suddenly all the networks are doing whatever they can. All the stars come out. The clothes come off. All kinds of stuff happens. All the networks pull out all the stops to get the highest possible ratings. Well, here at Late Night, we've decided to do a lot of really great stuff for sweeps so that we get the most people watching, maximize our viewership, you know? We've got a lot of stunts planned for sweeps. And I thought, hey, why don't I just tell you all about them tonight in a little segment we're going to call Sweeps Ahoy! Yeah. Okay. Um, now, one popular way uh, to boost ratings during sweeps is to take the show to some exotic location. For example, Jay Leno took his show to Las Vegas. It was a big hit. He was like, hello, Las Vegas. And they were like, yay. <laughs> I don't know if you remember, uh, the Facts of Life Girls went to Paris. That was a big, big deal. I mean, I didn't miss one of those episodes. Um, so it's a time-honored TV tradition. When sweeps roll around, you take your show to a different location. Well, we here at Late Night, we also taped our show in a different location not too long ago. Uh, of course, with our limited budget, we didn't get to travel as far as we really wanted to. But we did the very best we could, and it's going to air soon. I think it's going to be great. Take a look. The Brooklyn Bridge, a New York landmark since its completion in 1883, is perhaps the most influential... From three floors down in New York, it's Conan O'Brien! Yeah! <laughs> Woo, yeah! Hey, we got a great show. Excuse me, Stone. Great, great show tonight. Let's see what's going on. Well, President Bush, we just took it, took it downstairs. It was, it was great. Big laughs in that studio. Uh, now, folks, nothing grabs the viewer's attention more than a sudden surprise plot twist. It's just another common sweeps trick that you see in all the different shows. So naturally, we're going to have our own plot twist. In fact, let's have a big surprise plot twist right now. Conan? Afraid I've got some bad news for you. Well, what is it, Doc? Tell me. I can handle it. I'm having an affair with your mother. Oh, I, I thought you had test results or something. I do. She gave me the clap. <laughs> Mom's gonna love that one. Uh, <laughs> now, everyone knows how a musical score can add to the success of a movie. I mean, a musical store, score makes all the difference. Well, for sweeps, we asked Max and the band to play a really great sort of dramatic score underneath the entire show as if it were a big-time Hollywood movie. Watch how well the musical underscoring worked during my interview with Ted Danson just a few days ago. This is interesting. In your new mini-series, Living with the Dead, you get to work with your wife, Mary Steenberg. Yeah, we, ha we have cool. a great time working together. It's a, it's a joy. Yeah, well, I look forward to meeting her. Yeah. So, uh, Ted, what are you going to be doing next? me, Ted, or are you hiding something? What the hell are you doing? I'm sorry, Ted. You see, the truth is, I love you. I love you, Ted. Please say you share my feelings. No. No, Ted, you... you can't leave! Ted! You're my whole world! We'll take a break. We'll be right back with Al Roker. Okay, nothing attracts the public's attention more than a big controversy. So for sweeps, we're introducing Controversy Cow, the lovable cow who shocks America 
with his outrageous and controversial beliefs. <laughs> the way to save our economy is through child labor. <laughs> Moo! All Asian people are good at math because they cheat. Moo! All old people are gay. Wow, controversy cow. And I want to express those... Those are not our views. Those are the views of Controversy Cow. <laughs> now, we know many of our viewers are folks in their 80s and 90s. We did a study. Most of our viewers are in their 80s and 90s, and the reason they watch the show is they have various diseases which make it difficult for them to sleep. <laughs> so, during sweeps, Late Night is going to do a different salute to the elderly each night. And tonight, we're kicking things off by featuring Dade Yarborough. Now listen to this, Dade was Hollywood's leading stuntman back in the early 1930s, and guess what? He's still at it today. It's amazing. Where are you, Dade? What, what, what's that? What's that, Dade? Hey, Conan, watch out, Conan. I think he's gonna shoot you. <laughs> Would you uh, help me out here? <laughs> and finally, <laughs> the uh, the supposed rivalry between Jay Leno and David Letterman is really heating up, and I thought it would be a great sweeps event if we got them both in here to finally settle the score. Well, naturally, both Dave and Jay refuse. They're like, what are you talking about? No way. So we got the next best thing. Here to settle their differences once and for all are little Jay Leno and fat David Letterman. Let's see what happens. Take a little break. We come back. Larry King. 